Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Yeah! Hola gang and welcome again to Old Nerd Reviews. I'm Tony, your old nerd of the day, and I do try things so you don't have to. I've got oatmeal. Four packages of oatmeal. Today we're going to try one. Um, these are put out by General Mills, and they're a mixture of their cereals and their oatmeal. This here is a Trix oatmeal. All right, so uh, there are six servings in each box, so six packages, uh, 1.44 ounce servings each. Uh, instant oatmeal, so it's not like you cook it on the stove or anything. It says fruit flavored oatmeal naturally and artificially flavored. You gotta guess which one. And they have colorful, crunchy toppings. How you make this up is you pour the contents of oatmeal pouch into a microwavable bowl, add a half a cup of water, stir well. You can also add milk if you wanna opt for that. And then sprinkle the topping on the oatmeal. So two different packages, I'm assuming. That's it, and then eat up, I guess. As a kid, I like tricks. Um, haven't had it in decades, so I don't know if I'd still like it. I assume I probably would. All right, let's see what's in here. So we got a package of the oatmeal, and there is the topping right there. So a little, little package of that. So that, that. Okie doke, I say we go in the kitchen, make it up, let's go. Okay, so this is really not as cool as I thought it would be. It's not like Trix flavored oatmeal, it's like oatmeal, oatmeal, oatmeal <laughs> with topping on it. Okay, half a cup of water. Oh, okay, I missed the part that we're supposed to microwave this for a minute also. Well, I mean, I've got boiling water, almost boiling water from the spigot. So I'm really not sure whether I should... Man, I, I smell... I smell tricks. Is this really coming from this? Oh, it's come. I think, yeah, it's coming from the oatmeal also. So this is tricks oatmeal also. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to need to nuke this. So it's probably just if you have cold water. All right, so stir that a little bit. Tell you what, I'm going to put it in for maybe 30 seconds. Okay, all done. That thickened it up a little bit. So yeah, this this smells like tricks. So I was mistaken. It's not just the topping. It's the oatmeal itself too. All right, here's a look inside. We have tricks, little tricks. Pour some into my hand here. Little tricks <laughs> nuggets. <laughs> you know how bunnies leave little pebbles on their on behind them. <laughs> There's what the Trix Rabbit leaves behind him. All right, so let's go ahead and pour this on top. This really smells good. I didn't know what it would be like, but this smells has a very pungent odor of Trix. All right, let's try it. Here we go, gang. Last look at the Trix oatmeal. Okay, make sure I get some of the topping on there. Give it a shot. Get some more on the spoon. Do it again. It's real hot. All right, take it by the numbers. The smell, as opposed to the taste, is like vast difference. Um, very deceiving because right out of the box, as I poured the oatmeal in the bowl, had a, had a vivid smell 
of tricks. And then the, the tricks topping on top of that. And when I'm eating it, it barely even tastes like tricks. The topping brings it out a little bit more. That said, the topping is really weird. It's it's like when you when you bite into any kind of cereal, especially something like this, you, you've got a very nice crunch. These the they're almost the, the texture is almost stale, kind of like. It's not like it tastes stale, but it has that stale texture to it that has the little bit of give rather than the crunch. It's kind of turning me off. It makes me feel like I'm eating something stale. It is coloring the bowl. You can see some orange there, and you got some blue over here. And you know, maybe it's me expecting this to be like a bowl of cereal, a bowl of Trix cereal, and it's not, it's, it's Trix oatmeal. So, you know, maybe my expectation is a little off based on my past experience with Trix. All right, so I got all the oatmeals that I got. Like I said, those videos are to come. I got them over at Walmart for $2.50 a piece, two for five. So they were on special. I don't know how much they normally are, but right now, if you go over and get them, you can get them for two and a half. On the Nerdometer, I would give the Trix Oatmeal from General Mills, um, I would give this a, I would give this a low I like it. Um, it it's good. It's got a, a decent sweetness to it where you don't have to add sugar or anything to sweeten it up. No problem there. But it just has a very low key flavor of tricks. And I'm not sure if that's a good or bad thing. Maybe if it was heightened more, then it would be too sweet. I mean, maybe they were taking that into consideration. So. You know, I, I, I want to know from you guys, if you have tried this, what do you think of it? Leave it down in the comments. Um, I'm interested to find out your opinion on it. So there you go, gang, another review in the bag. Thanks so much for watching. Um, follow me on my social networks, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, on my website, at the Old Nerds toy store all those links are down below in the description and if you do all that you too can become a part of the yeah. coffee swilling i got my coffee this time old nerd crony community uh -huh. you guys have a freaking awesome day and i'll talk to you again bye now